In this video, I had my livestream viewers create their own fantasy RPG character that we then created in real time on stream using an AI art generator. Rat. You want to be a rat, okay. Uh, any other descriptors mommy. you can think of? Meet Rat Koo. Yeah, it's a mommy holding its, its child. Then, my buddy Charborg and his viewers came up with their own character abomination, Grug and Grog. Grug and Grog. <laughs> <laughs> Next, Charborg and I put on a live D&D style session where our viewers decided what their characters would do via Twitch chat and text-to-speech. Splash! You guys land in the ocean, ocean and <laughs> each time they entered a new scene, we generate a new background image based on their decisions and the consequences using Novel AI's text adventure software and AI art generator. This video is a highlight reel of Charborg and my chat's first adventure in this new show format, recorded live on twitch.tv slash Kraken. If you like what you see, consider checking out the links in the description to see the full VOD of the stream on my second channel, including some deleted scenes. Grog and Grog refuses to wait and eats Germans dead. What? <laughs> a painful death for little German <laughs> leaving behind a whole pile of bones. And be sure to watch Charborg's full video on his story that we did using the exact same format. Hope you enjoy the show and tune in live for the next one. I guess you should describe sort of the basic premise of your story so we know what kind of character we're going to generate on our end. Yes, the basic premise of my story. It has been 1,000 years since the Age of Dragons, and the realm has finally settled into a calm since the last dragon died. That is, until the dark wizard Plumbus began harvesting the dragon's power from their fossilized remains. Now, the dark wizard Plumbus threatens to bring about a new age of dragons, but this time, it's an age of dragon bones. Somebody has to discover where the dark wizard Plumbus has hidden his wizard tower and defeat him before it's too late. Guys, that's you, holy that's smokes. You. <gasps> that's you. Plumbussy? No, don't ignore that. Ignore that. Okay. <clears throat> Gruggle. Grug and Grog and Ratku have both received a letter by Pigeon of the encroaching danger posed by the dark wizard Plumbus. They have charted a ship to take them to his last known no location, the port city of Grandy. As the ship pulls into harbor, our adventure begins. Uh, Hungry. Let's see what eat the grog. AI comes up with. <laughs> they said eat Grog. <laughs> the game Yummy. starts with a view outside your room window overlooking the sea. Uh, this cabin, this is where you guys have been bunked up. Grog and time. Grog and Grog and Ratku, you guys have been sleeping under here. You know, you don't really have the, the nicest of, uh, of accommodations necessarily on the ship. Um, but... Grog and time. The ship got you to where you needed to get, which is outside Uncle. of the, uh, the city of Grandy. And now, uh, we get to figure out where you guys want to go next. Share bed. Share bed. Okay, they eat both ship. want to eat the ship, um, is what I'm gathering from both of them saying eat ship. Are you going to let these little freaks eat the no. ship? All right, you begin to eat some of the ship. Uh, how how much of the ship do you eat, guys? Uh, is it just a little bit for a taste, or do you keep going until you're stopped, basically? Oh. Okay, oh. Um, well, you eat all of the ship, uh, or at least enough of it that it begins to sink. Um, this... <laughs> uh, 20%. 20%. <laughs> okay, you eat 20% of the ship. Now, unfortunately, your position in the cabin means that all these holes are going to spring a leak, and uh, you find yourself falling into uh, the ocean. Splash! Uh, you guys land in the ocean, ocean, and you drink the ocean. <laughs> now, uh, you did just eat a whole bunch, guys, so I don't know if you can, if you can eat uh, you can also drink an entire ocean. That's a lot for your your little bellies. Even Grug and Grug. Drink ocean. I guess, got a much I guess let them belly. give it a shot. Let's see what the AI comes up with when they attempt to drink ocean. Thirsty. Oh God. Uh, sorry. Hold on. I just got e an updated image for Grug and Grog. If we want to use it. No. After he uh, has drank all the water in the ocean. Um, is this something you <laughs> would like me to <laughs> submit? Me Ew. Well, this is what they get, you know, if they're going to drink the ocean, then I think... <laughs> e -W you, you, you got, now you shouldn't have drank the damn ocean, Grog and Grog. Uh, this is Grog, uh, and then Grog down here is... Uh, e -W. 
I think he's going through the first stages of, um, like r rigor mortis or something. Like E W. <laughs> there's <laughs> gas and fucking like. No. <laughs> no. No. <laughs> Kill. The whale will start chasing after you if you keep going straight ahead. But there is another way to get rid of these angry creatures. I'm nervous. How, uh, guys, do you get rid of these angry creatures? Seduce. So there's. So they both want to seduce the whale. Seduce whale. whale. <laughs> All right, that's that's what we're gathering. Okay. Rug and Grog and Ratku attempt to work together to seduce the whales before they are eaten. You try to approach two huge female orc whales who are approaching to attack. Their leader is obviously frustrated that her pack was devoured at sea, and she wants revenge against anything male on board. Anything male on board? Okay. Uh-oh. We mommy. Okay. Well, Ratku is technically a mommy. Okay, so Ratku's gonna say... Oh, basically, you guys are playing yes. the we're not men, so don't worry about us. Uh, the adventurers convince the whale they are not men aboard the ship and therefore are not deserving of the whale's wrath. Show Jerma? Okay. Ratku shows the whale their baby <laughs> rat named Jerma to prove they too are a mommy. That's so sweet. The, the little adventurers rat arms. approach the two giant yeah. females to tell them what happened to their family members in a quest for revenge. One of the whales overhears a voice saying, Jerma, and decides it must be one of the little rats. It is, yeah. It's one of the little rats, see? Now what do you, you guys do? Eat Germa. Don't eat no. Germa. <laughs> no. <laughs> sure. Sure. Ooh, ooh. All right, they're, they're reaching a decision. A very kind sailor sees your plight and helps you get sure, ashore sure. without further trouble. It's finally time for some serious Rubinary. investigation. So welcome to Grandy, guys. Uh, you get to decide where to go now. These are the locations of interest that you guys can pick from. Walmart. Oh, no Walmart. Uh, you can either go to <laughs> the uh, the theater, Walmart, Council Hall, the Normal Bar, the Ganata Normal Bar, or Green Bottle Tavern. You can buy things bar. at a tavern. Bar. <laughs> brothel. Now there were two different bars mentioned, and there was no brothel. Tavern. Drug. Okay, there's there's three taverns. There's Normal Bar. Gnata Gnormal Bar and Green Bottle Tavern. So either say uh, bottle, uh, normal, or gnat. Bar. 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 <laughs> good, Greg and God. Good, good, Greg and God. You're doing yeah. it. So they go to the Green Bottle Tavern. That is all right. Wait. Welcome to the Green Bottle Tavern. This is a this is a goblin tavern actually. It's filled it's filled with goblins. And it's Grog and Grog don't get any ideas. It's a lot rowdier than uh, than the gnome tavern was. E.W. E. Goblin. <laughs> the adventurers goblin mode. leave the gnome tavern and head to the goblin tavern across the way. The tavern Kiss is goblin. filled with raucous goblin D's nuts. goblins laughing and cheering and yelling at each other. Grug and Grog and Ratku well. stand at the doorway. When they step into the hall, they encounter a drunk who starts talking too loud to be heard. They sneak past him <laughs> to the door, and then hear a clattering of pots and pans as the cook walks by. Oh, well, this place seems like a mess. What are you guys gonna do in here? New I wife. think Grug and Grog want to try to maybe seduce a goblin? Goblin wife. Oh shit, okay. You wanna, you guys wanna flirt with a goblin? Orgy. Okay, Raku, down. Okay, right. Raku, chill. This is Grog and Grog's time. All right, Grog and Grog is taking an action, so we're gonna yes. turn off Raku. Uh, TTS. What's your pickup line, Grog and Grog? Yeah. Say, say you yes. show up, you see a pretty little goblin sitting there. What do you say? Grog and Grog. Okay. <laughs> they, so they approach. Goblin D's nuts. Grog and Grog approach Grog and Grog. a uh, a <laughs> goblin woman sitting alone at a table nearby and says. Grog and Grog. Grog and Grog. <laughs> With intent to seduce. Let's see what happens. The goblin stands up smiling and approaches them. She smells delicious. <laughs> the adventurers discuss what it would be like for Grog and Grog to taste her cooking first. Okay, the I thought, oh agrees. my god. Oh. Okay, I thought they were going to eat the goblin. goblin right off the bat. Eat goblin. 
Uh oh, no! Guys, no! She's offering you guys. Grog and Grog, she's she's gonna cook you for you, man. Eat it's, goblin. She's gonna cook for you. Come on. Grog, Grog and Grog, please don't eat the goblin. This could be your chance at a new goblin eat wife. Goblin. What's the plan, Grog and Grog? Your call. Eat food. Okay, they're gonna eat the food. Okay. Grog and Grog. Eat goblin food. Agrees to try the goblin's food. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> But decides that if it isn't good enough, they will eat the goblin instead. All right, let's see what happens. If you eat agree, Dobacy. the game will continue. In order to get the grimoire away from what? the gnomes, Grogengrog decides to go grog mode and eat one of the. <laughs> no, the wait! Bar. Don't go back to the gnome bar. Bad. All right, retry. <laughs> Grog went back to the gnome. <laughs> Grogengrog looks down and sees a big bowl full of mashed potatoes. <gasps> Ooh. Raku takes a bite out of one of the potato Rock chunks mode. and discovers a magical effect of the magic of the mashed potatoes. A magical effect of the magic of the Whoa. mashed potatoes? What you find in there, Raku? What you find in the in the mashed potatoes? Yum. It just did it taste good? What what magic did it give you? Yum. <laughs> Raku. Try again, Raku. Bad. I spray you with water bottle. Uh, Raku gains smart. the magic powers of warp from these magic potatoes. These Glee. powers allow. Ratku to Giga teleport Grog. with unstable Glee energy I. around a 50 feet radius. Grug and Grog watches Ratku eat their food with in his eyes until he eats some himself. Then both start to laugh about how amazing this is. As they eat more, the effects on both characters are felt. Both feel oh, incredibly strong and energized. <laughs> <laughs> they both Dude, get I... they both get powers. Grug and Grog, how's it taste? Finally getting to eat something you're allowed to eat. Oh wait, little uh, Germa wants some. Oh, yeah, Ratku Yum. Yum. needs Yum. some of the magic Yum. mashed potatoes to baby Germa as well, hoping he gains the power of warp too. Germa enjoys the tasty food. The adventurers decide it's time to find Plumbus. Yes. The goblin girl gets mad when she realizes what Grog and Grog was really Kiss doing. Just wiry goblin. Grog and Grog, what were you really doing? <laughs> I think I think they She's had an ulterior now. motive motive to like try to flirt and marry goblin her. Goblin wife. Maybe okay, Grog and Grog. How, how we will let you back? propose to the goblin before we head out. Mary Goblin. However, okay. you will not eat. We you will not eat, try to eat any other people. <laughs> You're Can we to agree to that? With him. <laughs> if you propose, if you propose to this goblin, we will not eat anyone else for a while, for a little no. bit, uh, just a little bit. Wait, a Grug and Grog, realizing the mistake they made, decides the only solution Steel wife. is to propose to the goblin girl. Cuck. Grug and Grog <laughs> gets cuck. <laughs> gets down rat. on one. Misshapen deal <laughs> knee and asks the goblin This is it, Grug and Grog to be their wife. Alright, let's see what happens. When asked why, he explains that because they have discovered that the goblin has the magical properties of warps. Polyamory. But she says no and oh. leaves. D The oh. adventurers decide it's best to keep going toward the oh, dark wizard Columbus. Buddy, Grug that's Omega. rough. That is rough. She just says no. D. Grug, Grug and Grog, I will say Rip that Bozo. the decision to propose e after <laughs> Grug and Grog. <laughs> Omega you, you, I just wanna I just wanna let you learn from your actions here. You can't propose to somebody the day you meet them. That doesn't yeah, much yeah. less e the goblin. sentence you meet them. Yeah, they she made you food and you proposed Bozo. right on the spot. Eat goblin. Eat goblin. You really want to eat that goblin, huh? I, I don't think that's let, a healthy let, let way of dealing with rejection. Okay, fine. fine. <laughs> Rack, who wants to propose? Steal wife. <laughs> wait, wait, let's try that first. Okay. Rock mode. Before the goblin girl leaves, Ratku grabs her hand and asks if she would instead consider marrying them. Rug and Grog watches. Grog <laughs> said. She thinks about it for a moment and, and accepts the proposal with a kiss. Oh. oh. She tells them we, they can meet up with Grog. her later tonight. Grug and Grog. Thief. <laughs> <laughs> they Kill. stole my potatoes. They stole my wife. <laughs> if you guys want, I can sort of coach you on how to talk to people and how to have these exchanges. Kill rat. We're going to fast forward to later tonight at the wedding. Kill okay? rat. 
Rat Coo and Crash Wedding, wedding. Goblin. Mommy uh, mode. Girl uh, plan to have their wedding at the magical mushroom forest. Crash Wedding. Just outside <laughs> of town. Because Rat Coo doesn't and know. Grok. Rat Coo, are you really going to ban the, the, the no. other player in this experience from going to your wedding? That's like a next They'll level. They'll watch control. from afar. They'll watch from afar, Rat Coo. Yes. Oh my god. Yes. Right. <laughs> Mary Germa. I'm yes. sorry, Grog and Grog. You're going to have to wait outside. Crash apparently. wedding. Even though Rat Coo <laughs> went on this journey with Grog and Grog, she decided not to invite them to her wedding. Eat ring. <laughs> <laughs> and so he is forced grok. to watch the proceedings <laughs> Eat ring. from 100 feet away outside the location. When the night comes, Ratku goes back to the tavern while Grog and Grog remains by the entrance, watching the whole thing from afar. At the edge of the village, near the magic mushrooms, the goblins begin building an archway for the ceremony. Aw, oh, all the goblins oh. are helping! It's a whole, it's a whole event! All the family! Although, it, I don't think Raku... Raku, do you have anyone attending the wedding from your side? Aside from Jerma? <laughs> That's so sad. Hey, Plumbus? <laughs> you want to invite the dark wizard Plumbus to your wedding? Are you just trying to skip to the end by by <laughs> inviting the wizard in? Yes. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I, you know, I hadn't considered yes. this. Uh, but sure. Um, we have warp powers. That's true. Raku doesn't have many <laughs> locals to invite to their wedding. Plumbusy. So they try oh. a Hail Mary and invite the Dark Wizard Plumbus in case he decides to show up. Baby driver. As the last preparations are made, the bride enters through the portal, holding a the bouquet portal? of glowing flowers. As the vows are spoken, Plumbus appears behind the groom. <gasps> the goblin girl is startled when she sees Plumbus. Plumbus! Momkas. Mary Plumbus. <laughs> oh no! Grog and Grog, what you're happened not even to the plan? here! Are, what happened to the plan? What are you gonna do? We were gonna eat Plumbus when he got here, but they fucking changed it last minute. Mary so, Plumbus. Where is Grog and Grog right now? We were just kind of chilling outside, I thought. Yeah, they're they're a bit outside the venue. Can Grog and Grog see Plumbus from all the way over here? Well, it's a mushroom forest. I was kind of expecting them to kind of be peeking over. Seduce Plumbus. Warp. Grug and Grog, oh, yeah, you do have warp. True. Good good memory, Grug and Grog. All right. Grug and Grog uses their power of warp. Take the shot. To <laughs> jump. Okay, this is going to be nuts. Grug and Grog uses the power of warp to jump to the altar. Grog smart. In an Take attempt the shot. to eat Plumbus. Are, are they eating or trying to marry Plumbus? What, which one's Wait, Plum okay, Grug and Grog, what did you guys decide? Marry or eat? Yeah, you got to make Plumbus, the evil wizard of this universe? Mary. Okay, great. An attempt to Mary. propose to Eat. the dark wizard Plumbus. At the same Mary. time, the baby Both. rat Jerma takes Take the shot. a long range shot with their crossbow at the dark wizard Plumbus in an attempt to snipe him now that he's out in the open. All right. Let's see what happens. Let's this is all happening at the altar. It could go many different ways. Let's see. 50 calories. <laughs> Guys, I don't think he has a 50 Eat calorie rifle, calories. okay? I don't think we can use that. Yeah, it's a tiny it's a tiny crossbow. It only It's only 50 calories if you ate it. All right, let's see what happens. Derma's first arrow misses. <gasps> Grog and Grog's proposal ends short and fails, but Eat causes arrow. chaos. <laughs> Plumbus laughs and runs off before the adventurers can catch no! him. No! You guys <laughs> fucked it! No one wants Grug and Grog. When are you gonna get that through that dumb, that dumb double skull of yours? <laughs> D. What are you gonna do? Are you Mary gonna follow wife. him? Or are you finish the the Yeah, the, they could just the finish the wedding. I mean, you could finish the wedding, but then you'll Mary lose. Wife. You'll Eat lose. Goblin. The wedding resolves, and Walmart. Ratku kisses the goblin girl. They have a happy time. Grug and Grog is hungry <laughs> and feels they will eat soon they decide to chase Six after wife. the dark wizard plumbus again to capture or Honey kill Lord. him once more you have reached your destination <gasps> state room state room you arrive Whoop. at the state room which is where the council of dwarves manage all 
governance in this town. These are like the most influential kind of leave govern <laughs> leave. But I, I I designed this scene specifically for this part of the story. It's the perfect moment for for you to talk to the dwarfs council and get to get more information. Leave about people leave. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Raku's got a wife now. Raku doesn't really care about. <laughs> Raku's retiring from adventuring. Leave. Grog and Grog, you're gonna leave too. What about marrying the dwarf? <laughs> you're back at in the oh, world over map. <laughs> Where do you go now? You can go to the orchestra. You can go to Walmart. The deep dark woods, oh. or you can go to Walmart. The lady tree. That's uh, Grog and Grog. I don't want to get your hopes lady up here, tree. but lady tree. There is the <laughs> word lady. Lady tree. Lady tree. Lady. <laughs> There, look how many you're typing. <laughs> lady tree. Lady tree. Holy shit. <laughs> Suddenly their attention is peaked. Whoa. The lady tree. Mary tree. Old guy's ladybugs. Wow. The lady tree is filled with giant red ladybugs. Leave. Eat bug. <laughs> Eat bug. <laughs> I don't see any reason why Grug and Grog can't have a bug yeah, or two. Yeah, they can have a bug or two. Sure. Okay. Burn tree. Ratku seems disinterested as they are busy thinking about their new goblin wife. However, Rug and Grog is hungry. Burn tree. And decides to eat Arson. a few bugs. Wow, they're actually agreeing on burning Trust the tree. Going whole. Going, going whole. <laughs> 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 the way they said that. It looks a bit like a giant vagina with Dementia. roots. Okay, <laughs> right, hey, Grog, let's get out of the hole. There's a fountain where you can drink and cool yourself down oh while swimming in water, and then up to some sort of throne for Go royalty. Go in hole. <laughs> he sounds so excited now. Oh my god. Go in hole. <laughs> hey, no, Go it's all right. Hole. Sharp, we're going to play in hole. I play Okay, okay, okay. All right, it's, it's, all, it's all fine. Okay, the, the adventurers go into the tree's giant hole, and uh, what they find inside amazes them. Inside the tree is a little village of people made of bread. It's a little Whoa. bread village of cute little independent Look, little- Look, Grog and Grog, they're so Eat. cute. They're, they're uh -huh. Wait, no, <laughs> guys, guys, come on. You can tell by Eat. looking at them, they're completely sentient and, and, and self-sustaining. They they're have a whole culture. Little lives. They have a happy little life. And <laughs> bread. In, in fact, from looking at them, it, it seems like they actually it's like a utopia. Bread. Okay. Um, 50 calories. <laughs> giant lady tree. Nom nom. Grog and Grog and Ratku find a fantastical village of tiny people made entirely nom, nom. out of bread. Butter. These little bread villagers are going about their daily lives without a care in the world. That is, until <laughs> Grog and Grog oh, no. arrive and Ghost. begin scarfing them all down as they scream little bread screams. Bread village is toast. Grog and Grog gobbles the entire place and even the local godlike figure Yum. named Elvira who comes by to yell at them. <laughs> Grog and Grog decide to take a nap after eating so many delicious little bread folk. <laughs> you made Elvira the local Easy. god? Someone comes up and goes, what the fuck are you doing? And he eats them <laughs> he too. Z, Z, Z. He just falls asleep. Look, I didn't want to say anything, guys, but I had written in the notes Z, here, Elvira oh uh, actually had like the god-killing sword for Plumbus. Um, and you, Z, Z, you would have actually been able to just kind of skip to the end if uh, you hadn't ate them right away. But... Uh, uh, that's okay. They're um, asleep. Let him rest. Yeah, no. Nope. Had a long day. Yeah, let let the big guy, big guys rest. I guess uh, that's fine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Don't care. Don't care. <laughs> mm -hmm. Z Z Z. I literally finally agree on something. <laughs> oh my god, Don't I'm shoot. dying, dude. Do you head further into Snor. the giant tree, uh, or do you go back to town? Shoo. You know, you, you do notice there, it seems to go deeper. Vomit sword. Vomit sword. <laughs> oh, okay. Right. They seem to be in agreement. Well, deeper. as you go deeper, we come across a whole ecosystem, Daddy. including what a seems life. to be an old man living in an abandoned kind of shack. And he's living <laughs> alone, it seems like. It's kind of like an old hermit. And he, he eyes you as you two approach. A life. 
Cold, cold eat wife. man. Eat man. Okay. Grug and Grog, do you have any other... Uh, Marry man. His wife. <laughs> okay, marry or eat. That's really his only two. All right. After eating the Work little life. bread village and enjoying Work. a well-earned <laughs> nap, the adventurers head further into the magic tree and discover an old hermit man living inside. Take the shot. Wink. Grug and Grog approaches the old hermit. Wingman. Oh, you're going to be oh, the wingman, oh, Raccoon? Yeah. I like this. In an attempt to make a connection, rat. Ratku decides to play wingman Wing for rat. Grug and Grog. Wink. As they try, as they <laughs> wink. At this the is going to work hermit. out, Grug and Grog. I'm this feeling is, really confident. I, I, I do too. Look. You, you, you have Ratku, the master charmer bard, at your side. Let's see what happens. The old hermit begins telling tales of his past life, including being the dark Rat wizard friend. before he became a hermit. Wait, what? As he talks about the dark wizard days, rats emerge from holes oh. around him and eat him Gee. alive. No! <laughs> Wait, no! <laughs> it is... <laughs> Grog and Grog cannot win. I don't understand. They don't get dude. any wins, no. dude. What the fuck? No. Grog even tried to I'm help sorry. here. The rats came back. Well, like what? Uh, what I don't understand is, no. was this man just gonna get eaten by rats today? Like he's been down here doing his thing. Is, yeah, he's been fine he for just so long. Coincidentally, get eaten by rats the second we show up. Do you want to redo? Okay. Everybody seems to want to redo. Let's right, redo. Right. We'll, re we'll retry. Because this is the, the rare W for, for Grug and Grog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Unfortunately, when they do this, he starts yelling at them and scaring the shit out of both of them. <laughs> After this, Raku tries again to be friendly but still gets yelled at by this guy. <laughs> Damn, this guy got to calm down. Eat man. Oh, oh my god. Is, is, your, is violence the only answer, guys? I mean, maybe beating... Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yes. <laughs> okay. All right. Yes. To decide they <laughs> don't like this rude man very much and decide to kill and eat him. 50 calories. After chasing him <laughs> into his. Once inside the hut, they notice it smells terrible. They kill the old hermit man anyway and start devouring their food. Oh. There's no magic on the dead body, however. When the old hermit's ghost appears in front of them, it says, You have murdered me. <laughs> it sounds so sad. <laughs> you have murdered Wait, me. Wait, I want to try to generate an image for this. Eat ghost. Eat ghost. <laughs> you can't eat How are you going to eat Don't the ghost, care. guys? Zero calories. <laughs> Zero calories. After, after, yeah, after a brief shriek of shock, the adventurers... Zero calories. ...turn their attention to the ghost and look at one another. It's zero oh, calories, so why not, says Ratku. They begin to eat the ghost. The ghost screams Bustin. zero calories. An otherworldly scream, and it mixes with another Bustin. sound coming from outside. It sounds like something being dragged across a hard floor. The adventurers hear more noise from upstairs, along with what seems like moaning from below stairs. Huh? Both Raku and Grug and Grog know that they heard screaming from Grug somewhere else in the house earlier that morning. <laughs> Alright, yeah, where do you guys Grug explore? Do you explore... I mean, I, I thought this was just a shack. Creek. We can keep going, dude. Oh. Do There's an go? upstairs, apparently. Yeah, do you want to go upstairs? Do you want to go downstairs? Which one? Oh. Alright, you want to go upstairs? They go upstairs... <gasps> Who is that? They're met with a terrifying... Character. Mary. Who is this? Who is this horrifying Mary. creature that we're afraid of? We're Mommy. afraid of them. This is a Mary. scary <laughs> individual. This is someone we fear. Mary. Mommy. Wingman. Oh, Wingman. Okay, we could <gasps> go back. Yeah. She Hubba, eyes Hubba. them with a ghostly stare and they hold her gaze. Amina, Amina. Amina, Amina. Wait. Her name is Hubba, Elgina. Hubba. She is I'll also right. known as Goddess of Baked Goods, also called <laughs> Lunch Lady. <laughs> this is all the information we have on her. Marry Lunch Lady. I, are you sure she's going to want to marry you after what you Lunch eat? Lady. 
She might be holding a little bit of a grudge, Grug and Grog. Yeah, let's see. Eat lunch. Yes. This is the ghost of the bread villager that Grug and Grog ate. Don't care. <laughs> Earlier, she looks much more powerful and alluring now in her true form of lunch lady. Yeah, apologize. Maybe apologize to her, Grug and Grog. Yeah, Grug and Grog, what you, uh, how are you going to approach this? Grug and Grog. Grudge and Grog. <laughs> Zero calories. Sorry. Grug and Grog mumbles. Sorry. Sorry. To <laughs> the lunch lady as they realize. JK. <laughs> realize they. JK. Are the one that ate them earlier. Grog and Grog are hungry and feel they will Flirt. eat soon. Uh oh. Raku tries to ask the lunch lady if they can eat her, but it Not turns sorry. out the ghosts aren't real and therefore cannot be eaten. Oh. Well, you hear that first? Oh, there you have it. Sorry, yeah. guys. Yeah, can't eat them. But the, hey, there is still one more option on the table, Grug and Grog. You think flirt. of what I'm thinking? Grug and Grog. Let's have Grug and Grog flirt a little bit. Yeah, I think you're right. Grug and Grog needs a dub here. Raku, can you uh, you willing to wing, wing rat here? Wing rat. All right, wing rat. Love it. Grug and Grog approaches the spectral woman and says, what do you say? What's your line, Grug and Grog? Grug and Grog. <laughs> okay, I, we, we knew that was coming. Wink, Grug, Grug and Grog. Grog and winks. Grug and Grog and winks at her. Ratku backs up Grug and Grog by... What do you do, Ratku? How do you back up Grug and Grog? Use charm. By using their <laughs> charm to emphasize how great charm. Grug and Grog is. The ghost woman tells them to stop and that there was no way for Grug and Grog to see oh, a ghost okay. or talk to a ghost without getting charm eaten spell. themselves first by the same ghost they tried to seduce with charms and flattery. D. Oh, oh, ghost says, Grug Grug. You, can't, you can't talk to me until D. I eat you. Wait, is that a proposal? You guys want to be eaten? You've Boy. done a lot of eating this adventure. Maybe with eat the, me. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe the table should be turned a little. After eat me. some thought, Grug and Grog says... Okay, eat me, <laughs> and presents Mommy. himself to the lunch lady to be consumed. When they do this, the spirit of Elvira melts oh, away into nothingness, leaving behind only the dried-out skeleton of what used to be a large woman. Raku feels uncomfortable watching this, so she starts D. looking around in order to avoid staring at the skeletal <laughs> remains of Elvira. No, <laughs> another D. L. Another you L know. for Grog and Grog. He was threatened to be eaten alive oh. and said, "Okay, eat me." And, and, and then she and then he turns to bones. <laughs> As uh, the the maiden of this realm vanishes bones. you get jettisoned out of this green space and land you emerge ah. from the green obelisk that the freaking uh ghost lady was in eyes of cringe walmart, <laughs> walmart. <laughs> and what you see in Miss front wife. of you is none other than ah. a hidden tower in the woods could it be it smells of dark wizard energy coming from inside, and you hear cackling. Grog and Grog, I don't think this is Ohio or Walmart. This might Leave. be something a little more sinister. Leave? This might possibly be the, the go Plumbus home. Tower. Now, you want to go home. Leave. Mary Plumbus. <laughs> now, you do know that this is almost certainly where the dark wizard Plumbus is plotting his whole, you know. Leave. You, you're just going to leave? <laughs> If you don't, if you don't want to go in there, I'm not gonna. You know, this is a this we is can't a, make a choose you. your own adventure. We can't make you. <laughs> Mary Plumbus. Okay, I mean, and Raku Wing Rat. Oh. Okay. Are you Looks coming like around? Arson. Arson. You want to burn it? We can do a combination of all. Let's see how it plays out. Let's go one step at a time. Let's start by maybe we approach the wizard Arson. and try to romance them a little bit. I'm I'm waiting for confirmation from Grug and Grog. Either you go in there. Plumbusy. Okay, they're in. <laughs> that sounds like confirmation to me. All right. They enter Ooh. the wizard's tower and are met with none other than the dark wizard Plumbus, clad in purple uh, wizard garb. E Awuga. <laughs> Awuga. E w. Burn and, Ohio. Awuga. And the skull and Raku, different... do not be rude to Plumbus's, I mean, Grog and Krog's oh. wife here, please. Hot. <laughs> There's. You can see uh, he's Awoga. got a pillar of dragon bones behind him, and he's doing some freaking magic Seduce. in it. Seduce. And and you and he locks eyes Rat. with you as you arrive, and he and he smirks also as Flirt. he knew you were coming. The adventurers turn to leave and stumble Daddy. across the 
Chamber of the Dark Plumbus. Wizard Plumbus. I do want to point out, Grug and Grog, every time himself. you've winked at somebody, they have died or like Bite tried lip. to eat you. <laughs> Maybe a different approach than winking. The two stand facing this scary lip. adversary lip. and decide <laughs> what to do about him. Term spell. Now, I don't know if you have any magic, Raku, because you've... Twerk. <laughs> Maybe we have a like... Wait, you have warp. You have the power of warp. That's Twerk. all you have, okay, guys? You do have... You can, like, play a, an instrument if you want. That's fine. Sing. Okay. Twerk. Warp into <laughs> Warp DMs. into his DMs. Wonderwall. Ratku and Grug and Grog look at one another and nod. Wonderwall. Ratku breaks out into a beautiful rendition, a beautiful song that sounds like Strip. Like Wonderwall. Oh, hold on, Grug and Grog. Grug and Grog. Let's see how the music is received and then we'll go from there. Strip tease. No, that's more like it. Grug and Grog uh, begins to dance and perform e a strip tease in the hopes Mating call. of seducing <laughs> Mating call. E <laughs> Seducing Mating call. the Dark Wizard Plumbus. Unfortunately for them, the Dark Wizard doesn't seem Grand interested Grand. in dancing and decides to make Grodden Grog his new familiar instead. Uh, oh, Grodden Grog is happy about this and wonders why the others haven't gotten married yet. Oh. Grog and Grog just got turned into a familiar? W. Oh my. <laughs> I mean, he, it's, he's happy about it. Dude, this is a perfect enough for Grug and Grug. Look at him. Dude, look at him. This is what he was made oh, to he do. He is a familiar this entire Daddy. time. Leave. Leave? Okay. <laughs> this is beautiful. This is actually the... This Wait, is beautiful, this, dude. Is this the canon Leave. ending? Does Grug and Grug decide Daddy. to stay with the wizard and Rat who leaves to go be with their wife? This is, is this so where the party life. splits? This is so yes. beautiful, home. dude. Go home? Yes. Yes. Okay. How did this somehow managed to wrap itself up so nicely? Grug and Grog decides Miss to wife. stay with the dark wizard Plumbus as his freaky familiar Ratku shrugs and I. heads back <laughs> to, to town <laughs> to be with her new wife. This is, I'm gonna cry, dude. Bye. This is beautiful. Well, that about does it. Uh, you know, because, however, I do have one more scene. Because you didn't stop the Dark Wizard Plumbus uh, scene but 21 uh, triggers, uh, which is the bad end. Um, the Dark oh. Wizard resurrects the <laughs> dragons and they burn the town, uh, scorching everything to Clap. a cinder. Good ending. <laughs> Good, <laughs> Good ending. <laughs> The robot Switch on the right looks up at Dr. Roach and Slimantha and waves. Hello there. We can't stop cooking soup, says the robot in a cheerful voice. No! <laughs> no! <laughs> My voice! That! Where did all, oh, wait. Where did all of this come from? Asks Dr. Roach. 